DI Triers. Um, today's video is a closet tour. You guys have been asking me so many different questions about how I organize and just got storage together in my closet. So here we are. <sighs> it's it's so much and it just it makes me happy. It's so much easier to get ready to not go anywhere <laughs> when it's organized, but hey. So um these hangers are from Amazon. I really wanted to try velvet hangers because they do such a better job of holding your clothes up. Like your clothes are not gonna slide off of these. And they have these little grooves too for your straps. So I highly, highly, highly recommend these hangers. And they're pretty. For my pants, I tried a couple different options. Um, I love, 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 love these S hooks for my jeans. That's probably the number one question I get on our page is where did you get those hooks from? They're S hooks from Amazon in our storefront. And these are also in our storefront. I just needed something to hang up different skirts and things that don't have hooks. So these pants hangers are pretty cool. You can use the actual clips on them or just kind of hang them up regular style. I hear toddler feet. <laughs> yep. yep. Oh, okay. Say hi, Justin. Hi. Hey. <laughs> so when you watch our YouTube videos, I'm sure you notice our little backdrop. This is just kind of, I don't know, decorative, but still with purpose, which is my favorite type of thing. Um, the MC stands for material curls, of course. Ooh, ooh. Hey. <laughs> and then I just have a few purses and just, I don't know, places don't that don't really have a home, they have one here. These I absolutely love. These little things are picture, picture frame holders from Dollar Tree. So literally a dollar. I was looking into like clutch organization at the container store and you know, all those expensive places and to have like just little things that organize your clutches, it was expensive, a dollar. Best thing I bought. Josie, we're trying to record a video. Um, do you mind, uh, can you turn it down a little bit? Can I turn it down? So the other row of hangers were like my dresses, anything that was long. This is where I have all of my tops. Um, pretty self-explanatory. I know everyone's like, where's the rest of her stuff? Because I don't know too many people that can fit all of their clothing I right can. here. Oh. I don't have that much clothes. You wear the same rotation okay. because right. that's you as a person. All right. What I do is I actually rotate my stuff um, by season. So all of my winter sweaters and all that stuff is actually put up in the attic. And it just, it makes it easier and it looks a lot less cl The disrespect. <laughs> anyway. Um, I do stuff by season, so it just allows me to have some extra space and actually see what I have, and I really like it. Um, things that are random, like swimsuits and fanny packs and things I can't hang, I have up top. I love these baskets. I actually ordered them from the container store. I got a really good sale on them. They took forever to ship, but they were definitely worth the wait. They're the perfect height and everything. I have a step stool that's currently not in here, but I usually just hop on my step stool if I need something and grab it down. Next, Ooh. my shoes that I never wear because they hurt my feet. <laughs> um, I This was one of the first purchases I made when we moved into this house. I knew that I wanted my shoes organized on a bookshelf, on display, so I actually got these from Ikea forever ago. My dresser. <laughs> So, um, of course, my Frida art print was pretty much the center of what I wanted to do here. So, once I got that, I kind of decorated with gold because I'm extra and so is she. <laughs> when decorating a dresser, Danette's funny. She's always like, how do you know what to put? And I'm like, you don't. You kind of just put stuff on there and take out what you don't like and what you do like. So, this is what I came up with. This actually doesn't normally live here, but... I just wanted to see my baby first thing in the morning every day. So seeing him right here? Yeah. This it doesn't count. That doesn't count? Oh, okay. This is when he was sweet. <laughs> now he's kind of Chucky-ish. Yeah. So um, 
I have, of course, my jewelry. The ones, the pieces that I use the most are kind of just organized there. And my perfumes, you know, just nothing too crazy, nice and simple. My dressers, I actually went through and organized um, Marie Kondo, is that her name? Mm -hmm. Marie Kondo style. And I absolutely love how organized. Moment of truth, I was like, I don't remember what I did this morning. But it's just nice to have, I can fit so much more clothing in these drawers with that. I'm nervous to open these drawers. This one a little iffy, I'm just gonna hold that one back. Um, and then also the organizers we have on our Amazon storefront. These are my underwear. I'll give you a quick view. <laughs> but I use those for my underwear and just smaller things. My socks have them just to kind of hold it in its place. You know what you have, it just helps you stay organized. I have two bookshelves with, once again, all the shoes that I don't wear. Um, if you're wondering where my tennis shoes and just everyday shoes are, they're downstairs. I have some storage options downstairs and then I keep them kind of in the bottom of my closet just to keep them out the way. They just don't look as pretty. This chair is actually my vanity chair. It does not live here. It lives in front of my desk, but it's blocking my clothes hamper because, oh, I'm, gl I'm glad my drawers are clean because this kid is exposing me right now. You know how people do it for the gram and YouTube and be fake? This shows that I am not. My drawers are actually organized because, yeah. So this chair actually is my vanity chair. I have it here because my clothes hampers right here and I just, nobody really needs to see that. But all in all, this back wall is literally my favorite part of my closet. We posted a YouTube video on how to do a DIY brush stroke wall. We've had a few friends try it out since. It literally just, I'm so proud of this wall. I just, this closet is something I could have never dreamed of and it's mine. And I did it myself. Best part. <laughs> my vanity. These do not live on my vanity. Last but not least, my vanity. I evicted myself from our bathroom counter a while ago. Um, I, Mez's patience and the amount of stuff that I had on that counter is so admirable. But I just wanted a nice spot to be able to sit and do my makeup, have it organized, not be throwing shit everywhere because I don't know where it's at. You know, we all know. So um, this is what I came up with for my vanity solution. Um, I pretty much bought different cute things that i saw in the store i believe this one was from tj maxx a little gold piece this was probably from tj maxx i don't know this definitely was but i just like that i have things organized this is a lot of skin stuff i don't know what's in here and then my drawers of course I have most of my palettes all types of stuff you know hookah tips Whatever you need. <laughs> Whatever you need for a night out. <laughs> a lot of these I got from Target. The white ones are actually from Dollar Tree. So really just finding things to organize your drawer. You'd be surprised at how helpful it is. It seems simple like, why do I need little compartments? But when you do your makeup, you'll appreciate and Knowing understand. exactly where you need everything. Listen, mm -hmm. listen. And then, of course, one of my favorite features of this vanity is the built-in charger. It's just nice. Oh, that it's thing's so charging. nice. Ignore my crack screen. Josie just broke my phone, but it's nice. And then, of course, my mirrors. This one is, like, the lighting on it is so bomb. Hey, guys. Yeah. <laughs> and then when you need to be up close, Lassie. I think the battery's dead on this one. If you have a toddler, a child, then you know they're not to be trusted. <laughs> he just, it's that. But I use this like for, of course, my up close makeup and my eyes and all that stuff. Y'all would think my face be beat every day the way this is set up and you see it. It's not. <laughs> but it is nice to have. Uh oh. He just saw it. See, this is why my battery. He's like, that one doesn't work, gotta move on to the what? next. Look at him trying to climb. Oh. 
He's not gonna let me close these drawers. So we'll have to just. Yeah. <clears throat> <laughs> Hi. 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 He saw it. Hi. He saw it. <laughs> the way we just coughed the close. <laughs> I wanted to give you a nice view of my rug, you know, the way it's supposed to look without all the shorts pulled out, but, and trucks on it, we might have to show y'all later. But on um, this rug I got off Amazon, I just love, it's not even <laughs> centered correctly, um, I just love the way rugs can pull together a room and a look. This one, when I ordered it, <laughs> Josie loves it too. It's a Josie approved rug, clearly. <sighs> When I ordered it, I thought it was black. It's not, it's like a dark gray, but it still works really well in here. And of course, anything with a tassel or a braid, sign me up. I absolutely love this space. This is the only room in the house that is supposed to just be mine. But as you can see, sometimes <laughs> I have a little party crasher, but I encourage you to organize your closet if you need some tips.